All right, I'm back and the box is here and it's awesome. I have not looked in it yet. It better be awesome. Okay. So I took back the 24C and I talked to musician's friend and I told them that I wanted something a little bit better. Um, what happened was the 24C was a used product instead of a new product. Uh, I told them that I bought the product new, and since it was pre-registered, they uh, gave me $20 off for the inconvenience. So, let's open up this new box. Here we go. I already cut it. I didn't look at it, though. So, no cheating. Alright, so, paper is from Musician's Friend. Don't want you guys to see my address because I don't want no visitors. It's just how I is. Alright, here we go. Studio 26C. One step up from the 24C. And the difference is, is what I've heard about this, is that they said the better, the better it is, or the higher, not the higher, but... I've been told that it has good preamp, uh, clean preamps, which the 24C does too, but the 26C has a monitor button so that you can listen to yourself sing without using the process from a computer. So if you, and it has an A and B, so you can switch between speakers, but I only have one set of speakers, so, you know, that's that. But the monitor thing is if I am... Um, if, if I'm trying to do, uh, uh, a rap, a uh, rap or sing or whatever, uh, I can hear myself without using the processes from the computer so it doesn't slow the computer down as I'm recording. One thing that would be even cooler is if you could do the same thing as the VSL and see this one's all pre-wrapped and everything. The other one wasn't even wrapped like this, I don't think. But the way they had, the way that VSL was is that you can actually have the reverb and all that stuff while you're recording. So let me open this up for a second. I'm going to put you down for a second. Put you down. You need to put you down. Oh. All right. Oh, bring it up. There it is. Okay. So. All right, here we go. All right, it looks a little bit just like the 24C, but it has these four buttons. It's got the 48 volts for phantom power, the line, the AB, and the monitor. So if I wanted to hear myself without using the processing from the computer, I just hit the monitor, and I can hear the dry vocal of what's coming through. One thing that I didn't like about the other one was that these knobs are not spaced off, spaced apart very good. As far as turning them and stuff, it's like your finger, your fingers, like it's really small space in between these right here. That's one thing that I, I, I think would be nice if they spaced them out a little bit further. But other than that, this thing better be brand new. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. But look, it has the left and right and has another one right here. So if you want to, you can hit the line button and I guess it switches speakers. And stuff headphones midi in and out like the other one the only thing different is these two things the monitor and it has these four buttons here so i'm very excited to be able to hook this up and get some sound out of it and hopefully start doing some recording and stuff and I'm, i may do a video on the sound quality i have a rode nt1 and i've been told that the noise floor um i think they said noise floor whenever i was doing research said that it's uh, that this would be a perfect combination for a Rode NT1 because they uh, they say the Rode NT1 is one of the quietest mics and this is a uh, quiet um, interface. But, uh, yep. So, all right, I hope you enjoyed this video. I had fun making it. But the Studio 26C, I will do an update uh, after I hook everything up. I'm going to try Studio 1 version 5 as well because I've got three professional uh, Studio One 3 professional but uh, since this comes with Studio uh, version 5, Studio One version 5, it's probably made for Studio One version 5 so I might, you know, be better as far as the drivers and stuff working with that program. So I'm going to try that out and I'll do an update video and uh, tell you guys uh, what I really think about this after I hook it all up and stuff. Alright.
Um, yeah. All right. See ya.